Hey, here we talk about chocolate. Uh, there are different use of chocolate, including、um, sweets, pastry, ice creams, icing cakes, etc., etc.、Um, there are two types of chocolate. One is、um, compound chocolate. Another is curvature. Curvature chocolate is a high-class product.、Um, so you know, it's smooth and refined. It is manufactured from cocoa mass, sugar, and cocoa butter. To produce a milk curvature, full cream milk solids are added to cocoa butter and sugar. The cocoa butter gives the impression of cooling the mouth as it melts.、Uh, why the reason?、Uh, because the melting point of the cocoa butter is、um, just below our body temperature. Because the curvature contains cocoa butter,、uh, it needs to be tempered before use. And there are usually two methods which we're not going to emphasize here. One is tabling, another is seeding.、Um, you could Google or YouTube those if you're really interested.、Um, so the purpose of tempering is、um, the cocoa butter itself has two types of fat crystal.、Uh, those two types of fat crystal has two different melting point. So if we not temper the curvature, the cocoa butter would set, and it just doesn't looks good.、Uh, it doesn't provide、uh, the smooth texture and appearance. So tempering is a process where the curvature chocolate is melted、um, at specific temperature and then cooled to enable the cocoa butter、um, to bind together. The two different type of fat crystal bind together, and because the process takes a lot of time, effort, as well as skills, experience,、um, most restaurants do not do this way. They use、um, the compound chocolate instead, which is a lot easier, cheaper,、um, and of course, it's not taste good, as good as the curvature. The Primary difference of compound chocolate here is、um, it's using vegetable fat instead of the cocoa butter. So that's what you need to know. And comes down to melting chocolate.、Uh, in order to melt chocolate, we chop the chocolate into small pieces and put it into the container of bain marie、uh, with water not exceeding 49 degree. And always make sure the chocolate temperature not exceeding 37 degree. Why the temperature matters? Because、um, if you have too much heat, it will make chocolate separate and lose its growth and become granular and、uh, solid rather than liquid.、Um, another thing is that just be careful. Do not let chocolate become contaminated with、uh, the water, the moisture, the steam,、uh, because they have the really bad effect. By changing the chocolate consistency,、um, and that's it. Thanks for watching.